subscribe to join us and our travels as we share our life on the sea. I'm going to show you guys my morning routine this morning. We woke me up about 4.30 because it was really windy, so it was all, we had all clothes hanging up and um, we're just, we're all tied up raft over three other boats, so it was just a little bit worried, so we had to wake up, but everything was all good. First thing I do when I wake up, I scrape my tongue, and the next thing I do is oil pull. Put some coconut oil in my mouth, and then I swish it around for about 20 minutes. Oil pulling is an ancient practice that involves swishing oil around in your mouth to remove bacteria and promote oral hygiene. I make sourdough bread daily, and this bread was the bread I made yesterday, ready to bake this morning. It takes about 30 to 40 minutes for the bread to cook. So while I wait, I continue to swish the oil around in my mouth and I'll roll on my yoga wheel and do any dishes from the night before. We are in one of my favorite anchorages. Appalachian sunrise meets my skin. Even with my eyes still closed, feel it coming in. Golden, I'll follow on golden. Yoga and meditation are the most important part of my morning routine. And the beach is my most favorite place to practice. Moving and stretching makes me feel good. And that's why I make time to do every single day. Sometimes others join me, but no matter what, I will always do some yoga. I'm not a morning person. Unless it's six foot pumping, barreling waves out there, you might see me out at first light, and that's my idea of a morning uh, get up. But apart from that, if it's not doing that, cup of tea, biscuit. Usually when I'm done, everyone else is awake and it's time for a smoothie. Our smoothie this morning has frozen bananas, frozen papaya, cacao, cinnamon and coconut milk. Kitchen's clean. Uh, the bread, I've got one more fold and then I'll put it in the fridge. I've cooked the bread and I'll probably go and edit for a couple of hours now 
or I'll go for a salt board or we'll go have an adventure. Doing something, go for a dive. I don't know, every day is different, but I just wanted to give you guys a little bit of an insight to my morning routine. Pretty much every morning when we're in anchor is how it is if I don't do yoga on the beach. I do it on the boat, but um, yeah, that's a morning in the life of me. And me. Now let's take you on another family adventure in Wyag. We made it. Tide coming in. Are we going out? Oh, we made it. Woo! We'll try adding another 50 kilos onto that and doing that. These paddles have to be. Trying to film and hold with one hand, Alan. You're making it really hard, wobbling all over the shop. Sorry. Hey. How do us non yogi people do that? Oh, is it better to come at high tide? Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. Why are you trying to come this morning? Okay, okay. 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 I'm going to come up, baby. Okay. Like another one. Good job, Ty. One, two. <laughs> yeah, you're just gonna let the away. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, 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 I'll come hold it for you. I'm actually coming. Matt, can we come? <laughs> I need to go back out so I get the whole thing. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was funny. There you do it, ladies and gentlemen. Stretch those legs this morning, I did. <laughs> Might not be able to move tomorrow morning, but we'll see what happens. That was so easy. I make sure my grip's in there though. Oh. Liam just like went with all these weight on me. I was like, well. That was trust right there. That was pretty yeah. good. I, be I believe in you. Yeah, do that. That'll be yeah, easy. I've got a good grip there. That's perfect. I can get you up real me. easy. You're not going to let me go. No, I've got a grip there. I didn't have a grip with Liam then. <laughs> <laughs> I was just using my weight. <laughs> I weigh him. Liam's made it look really easy. Um, I'll tell you what, Tara. Yeah. Grab with your other hand too on my wrist. Oh, that's real favourite. Do ah! <laughs> You ready? <laughs> <laughs> you have to get your leg though, because I'm flat on. Anyway, Anybody? onto the rock. Ready? Okay. <laughs> that was actually the greatest show. Oh, like, that was <laughs> beautiful. Do you want a grip? We should do I'll that on the front of the boat. <laughs> you guys go. Ah, the cat. Come on, mate. I'll give you a hand. The tide's gone down a bit. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you just gotta go. Yeah, well, Matt's the last one. No one's there to push the <laughs> kayak back under. Once he lets go, he's gone. Take yeah. his hand, Dad. Take his hand. Come on. Okay. Pull you up like you did, Tara. Home, <laughs> <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. He's got it. <laughs> he doesn't wear that shirt for no reason. Oh, well done, everyone. Yay. Thank you. Oh. We're off. We're off to see the wizard. We trust this yeah. rope. Oh. 
I'll let you go. I don't trust any boats. Are you sure? That looks pretty new. Yeah, the girls have been up it. <laughs> you say that something's got to give. You say it's one way to live. Yet you sit and wait for better days. I think we must push through the gray. <laughs> Watch your head. I think we're nearly at the top. Not really sure we haven't done this one before. Oh, it's pretty nice view already. Check that out. you do early in the morning, hey? <laughs> Alright, so the kids finally caught up. We're up at the summit now. <laughs> Raz Rampat. Look at these adults, eh? Hey? They nailed it. You'd think that's sweat, but we just had a little shower it's come through. Just what do you reckon, Tara? City folk back home have pictures on the wall. This is our backyard. Nearly, nearly there. 